All right, so we haven't done a blog together in a while. Uh, I did one last week, I think. And yes, I did shade, for those of you who are noticing something different here. You did shave. I did shave. He always busts my chops, literally, <laughs> telling me how I shave all the time. And now he goes and does it. So we're here in Studio 34. And then we're sitting next to the Jeep Willis. Yes. And uh, we got a live studio audience. Yay! <laughs> and we're drinking coffee out of martini glasses. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> because I don't drink. Living the sweet life. Neither does he. I do drink coffee in the morning. That's true. Right. You know what? I'm an idiot. Because we could have used the other camera. Which camera? My camera. The screen TV camera. Well, we can stop it and do it again. We can do that. Okay. There's not going to be a buzz of it, but we're not going to look yellow. That's true. I wonder if it works through a USB, because I don't have a firewire cable. You don't have a firewire? No. Hmm. Just read the scripture. Alright. Already <laughs> scripture. I need an olive. Ew, you like olives? Mm -hmm. That's gross. I like olives. <laughs> What's wrong with you? I like all of them. Okay. Um. Uh, see, I just finished this book. Actually, Axe, really good book. Yep. Just trying to pick a chapter. Take your time. Okay. You know what? Let me just read about Saul's slash Paul's conversion. Ooh. All right. <laughs> Settle down there, Skipper. <laughs> there were coffee grades in there. <laughs> really? Okay, read. You read. All right. All right. So you read. <laughs> okay. So I'll convert Chapter 9. It's a longer one. Um, you know what? I'm just going to read first two sections here, right. up to verse 19. Then Saul, still breathing threats and murder against the disciples of the Lord, went to the high priest and asked letters from him to the synagogues of Damascus, so that if he found any who were of the way, whether men or women, he might bring them bound to Jerusalem. As he journeyed, he came near Damascus, and suddenly a light shone around him from heaven. Then he fell to the ground and heard a voice saying to him, Saul, Saul, why are you persecuting me? And he said, Who are you, Lord? Then the Lord said, I am Jesus, whom you are persecuting. It is hard for you to kick against the goads. So he, trembling and astonished, said, Lord, what do you want me to do? Then the Lord said to him, Arise, go into the city, and you will be told what you must do. And the men who journeyed with him stood speechless, hearing a voice, but seeing no one. Then Saul arose from the ground, and when his eyes were opened, he saw no one. But they led him by the hand and brought him into Damascus. And he was three days without sight, and neither ate nor drank. Now there was a certain disciple at Damascus named Ananias. And to him the Lord said in a vision, Ananias. And he said, Here I am, Lord. So the Lord said to him, Arise and go to the street called Straight, and inquire at the house of Judas for one called Saul of Tarsus. For behold, he is praying. And in a vision he has seen a man named Ananias coming in, and putting his hand on him, so that he might receive his sight. Then Ananias answered, Lord, I have heard from many about this man. How much harm has he done to your saints in Jerusalem? And here he has authority from the chief priests to bind all who call on your name. But the Lord said to him, Go, for he is a chosen vessel of mine to bear my name before Gentiles, kings, and the children of Israel. For I will show him how many things he must suffer for my name's sake. And Ananias went his way and entered the house. And laying his hands on him, he said, Brother Saul, the Lord Jesus, who appeared to you on the road as you came, has sent me that you may receive your sight and be filled with the Holy Spirit. Immediately there fell from his eyes something like scales, and he received his sight at once. And he arose and was baptized. So when he had received food, he was strengthened. Then Saul spent some days with the disciples at Damascus. Cool. So I love that story. An amazing conversion of yeah. this guy who killed Christians and... Put them in jail and hated them. 
Saul, of course, was standing next to, uh, holding the coats of the people that were stoning Stephen, the first modern Christian martyr. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, it's, it's an amazing story. And uh, just think about being Ananias. Um, yeah, you know, you, I mean, so like, go go to this guy. This guy kills Christians. Like, okay, go to this guy. You know, yeah. I. What would you do? I mean, you know, I'd be afraid. But then God says, you know, do it. I'm a strong guy. So you had some ideas. Do it. Oh, you just you think putting me on the spot like this is just funny? Yeah. Because it. it doesn't bother me. Well, you were, you said you had some ideas for. To do. Don't you know what I'm joking? No. I have a great idea. Okay, do it. How about we go show them your office? I know they've seen it, but I have never seen it on the camera yet. Alright, another thing. We need to uh, reenact a scene from Kyle's stream. That's why I actually want to go to your office. Okay, so let's do that first. So we're going to reenact Kyle. This one's for you, man. This is a reenaction of your dream, okay? So just hold on a second. Here it comes. Okay, so this is the famous monkey, okay, from Kyle's dream. Roberto, the monkey. Okay, whatever. <laughs> well, Kyle told me his name is Roberto. Roberto? Roberto. Roberto. <laughs> Roberto. Okay, so this is a very crucial part of the dream, and so we just wanted to show you this before we reenact it. Okay. So we can stop it now. Over the moon. Ah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. This is just a reenactment. Ready? Here we go. Take two. You painted over the monkey. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That's for you, Kyle. <laughs> He's alright. He's alright. He's alright. All right. <laughs> that was great. Yeah. Oh, watch that. <laughs> I mean. All right. So, okay, so that was a reenactment of uh, Kyle's dream. Yeah. I think it turned out pretty good. Did you just fart. No. Oh, is it true? Yeah, it was no. <laughs> I didn't know. It was the <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching our vlog. Yeah. And uh, so, that was pretty good. Thanks yeah. for coming on the vlog, by the way, dude. I know, right? What the? <laughs> I guess that sounds mean street music. Uh oh.